Hello my friends, my name is Mohamed Naveed and in this lecture I am going to teach you masking in Adobe Premiere Pro. So what basically masking is? Let's see. In order to learn masking, first we need to have a video. So what I did, I, I came in project panel and what I did, I double click on it and I imported a video. And as you can see that right now I have this video. Now what I do, I just simply click and drag this video to timeline and as you can see that now I have this video. Okay. Definitely this first is showing video and definitely this second layer is showing audio. I will just simply click and drag this because I don't need this anymore and also this project panel because we will only work on effect controls. If you're not able to see this panel, so go in window and make sure that your effect control is checked. Then we will come in definitely in effect controls and here we can see the options. What I do, I will click on opacity and as you can see that right now I have these options. Actually these options are for masking. So what basically masking is? If I click, as you can see that right now I have this ellipse getting me. So I have a mask, you can say accord, uh, I have a mask like uh, ellipse getting me. And whatever is inside of this mark, definitely inside this circle is it showing, getting me. So for example, if I want to change the position, definitely I can also change. Let's suppose if I want to animate, for example, if I want to animate this, for example, at the beginning show this, next frame show this, third frame show this, getting me. So I can also do this with the help of masking, getting me. So definitely is very similar, like I can say, to, I can say spotlight. For example, if you talk about, uh, let's say that today, or uh, let's suppose you go in uh, musical night, okay. So you know that if you go to musical line, so you you may find definitely, uh, definitely you must find definitely uh, m uh, you can say singer definitely. So what they do that uh, definitely they they dark definitely they they they, uh, they dark every place and what they do that they they just put they just put light or spotlight on just on the singer getting me. So definitely same here. Let's suppose if you just want to see this part, so definitely we can do with the album mask. We also have this, for example, if I come and if I click on this, so definitely I can also get something like this. Means I can also get the rectangle like this, getting me. Or I can also use this free draw bezier. Because here is just showing circle or ellipse or definitely rectangle. Let's suppose if I if we want to draw our own. So how can we do? Definitely with the help of this we can draw. Let's suppose if I want, so I will click on this free draw bezier. And definitely I'm freely I can do. For example, as you can see that I'm click. I'm clicking and I'm doing getting me as you can see that now I have this mask getting me. So definitely with the help of uh, free door bezier, here, so we can freely draw our you can say masking. So what is the work and why do we use it? Let's suppose uh, it masking the again there are many there are no, again, number of usages of masking, but most commonly use masking for you can say we use uh, masking for for example in a video for example if you want to hide the face of someone getting me so definitely you will take the help of mask let's suppose in your video let's suppose if you want to hide your background if you want to hide something so definitely you will use a definitely masking get, getting me so now we have definitely we have covered this tools or this options of uh, this or we can say mask mask so now we should see the options of mask so what do we have first we have feather for example if i click and drag so definitely i can change the feather so what should i do i should go i should say control z and i should go back and as you can see that now I have this, just this. And in order to select this, you know, in order to select this, because if I'm uh, right now, as you can see that now I'm, I'm trying to select this mask, but I'm not able to do. I'm not able to select this. Why? Because I'm not click on mask. So just click on mask. Now you will, uh, as you can see now, I'm able to select my mask, and can change the position of this mask. So the first is feather. So what basically feather is? Feather is like this. Okay, it will be like this. Okay, feather. So feather, if you say feather, 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 so definitely it will uh, make something like this. If you want to change the opacity, definitely let's suppose if you just want to show just this part or just if you want to show, if you want to change the opacity, definitely you can also change the opacity. In easy word, we can say the visibility or the light. And then we have expansion. Let's suppose if you want to expand. So how can you expand? Just simply click and drag, come in mass expansion and definitely click and drag. As you can see now I'm expanding. So let's suppose if you want to give uh, you can say effect like this, so definitely with the help of uh, this mass effect expansion you can do. Get him. Then we have the option called uh, definitely invert. Invert is very important. 
So if I click invert, so that it will do the opposite of this. Uh, getting me? So now as you can see, that now we are able to see all the part, but we are not able to see just this part. Getting me? So it is very useful when we want to hide the face of someone. Getting me? So because in our video we want to show everything, but just we don't want to show the face of someone. Getting me? So definitely we will take the help of invert. We can also change the opacity of our video as well. Getting me? So this is the work of mask, and we can also do animation. Of this man. For example, if we talk about the face of someone, so definitely he will not keep face on same place. Getting me? Let's suppose if he is changing the face. Let's suppose uh, in the, in this video, for example, uh, now his face is here, in, uh, in another frame is uh, his face is here, another frame is face is his, uh, his face is here. So definitely we also have to change. Uh, definitely the you can say the mask so how can we change definitely we will do the an animation in order to do this we need to just simply click on this uh, definite uh, clock and this click and as you can see now I have this keyframe and let's suppose if I come here and if I change the position as you can see now again I have keyframe because I have, I have click uh, definitely this clock and if I come again and if I change the position again and again come and again change the position getting me and if I play this as you can see that now with uh, with my, my with my uh, with my video, you can see it is also changing. You know, as I'm going for forward, definitely is also changing the position of this. Uh, uh, you can say mass as well. Getting me? So it is very useful. Now I'll, I will come in effects, and uh, definitely uh, we will learn that how to use this masking, how to use mask in with the help of uh, different any effect. For example, let's suppose if I use Gaussian Biller. So I, what should I do? I should go back or I should start from beginning now. So I should delete this and I, I can now I have again a new uh, you can say video. Uh, then what I do? Let me come in the first. Okay, that's fine. Now I will take the help of this Gaussian blur. So what I I will do? I will simply click and drag. And as you can see that if I come in this effect controls, so as you can see that right now I have this Gaussian blur getting me. So with the Gaussian player, uh, Gaussian player is also giving us these options as well, getting me. So definitely if, if I click, so let's suppose if I just want to blur just one part, if I just, I don't want to blur, uh, you can say all the video, I just want to uh, blur just a specific part. So definitely I can do how, see, so I will come and I think I will click on the blurness and I just simply click and drag. So as you can see that now I'm just getting blur, get blur just, just on this, uh, you can say just this. Uh, circle ellipse getting me let's suppose if I'm coming here as you can see that now I'm getting blurry getting me so it is not it is not blur, it is not blending all the video but just blend the they can say the part so definitely if you take the help of this for example free to bezier and let's suppose if you uh, if you draw the bezier getting me if you draw some part of and let's suppose if you just want to hide if you just want to hide something if you want to uh, blur something so definitely uh, definitely with the help of this you can do how see for example if I go back if I do control Z control Z and again control Z and again I take the help of goes in below and uh, should do this and now at this time if I say that uh, draw free draw bezier and if I click 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 and just click getting me and let's suppose if I have this part okay in, in, in my video I just want to hide or if I just want to blur this part so if I go and if I say that uh, if I change this as you can see that now I'm just getting blurred in just, just in this part getting me so definitely with the help of uh, definitely masking definitely we can do many I can do very interesting in, in interesting things so this was a lecture on masking definitely you cannot only apply or you cannot only use masking with just with Gaussian blur there are many uh, uh, effects are available so definitely you can also apply and you can also use masking with this effect as well so I hope you've understood for more videos lecture and exercises come to my website www.navitplace.com I love you and I will meet you in the next video till then Allah Hafiz